On October 13th, the USAID Economic Growth Office Director Michel Kosielski visited two enterprises in Kakheti region. Ms. Kosielski was accompanied by David Sitlaza, Director of the Rural Development Agency of Georgia. The aim of the visit wasn't just opening two additional industrial units in Georgia, but reassuring that USAID stands with Georgia and unceasingly supports the improvement of agriculture in this country. The delegation started the tour in the town of Sagarejo, where they launched a new enterprise, Biovita. This new facility, which will produce organic mineral fertilizers and serve thousands of Georgian farmers, received nearly 120,000 US dollars with the USAID Agriculture Programs grant. <laughs> Not only the USAID, but SIF, the Small Enterprise Assistance Funds, played its role in launching such an important enterprise as well. The company invested 250,000 US dollars to cover nearly 50% of all costs of the project. As the delegation members concluded their visit to the Biovita in Sagarejo, they headed to Jugaani. In the village, they met Elder Mildiani owner of GVN Enterprise, facility which processes walnuts. I am a project that I am working on. I am a project that I am a project that I am a project that I the company was founded in 2020, but it is thanks to the USAID Agriculture Programs grant that Mr. Mildiani managed to buy and install three-level walnut rind equipment. Today we opened an organic fertilizer production facility which will help serve thousands of Georgian farmers. And we also opened a walnut processing facility which will help Georgia export walnuts to high-value markets such as the EU. This is another example of how the U.S. government supports the agriculture sector to help further prosperity in rural communities. Not only USAID, but RDA gave the helping hand to the company as well. The association subsidized their bank loan for 1,200 square meter processing facility. company New facilities in Jurani and Sagarajo will surely play an important role in improving Georgia's agriculture sector, while locally produced organic fertilizers will help thousands of farmers to produce ecologically sound products. Hundreds of tons of Georgian walnuts will go on export to the EU and Gulf countries. And so the USAID will proudly continue supporting and enhancing Georgian agriculture.